What's up guys, it's Trevor with Embers Living. Today we have an awesome new video because check out this awesomeness behind me right here. This is our new true display in our showroom. Not only is the display gorgeous, but let's talk about the equipment. How beautiful are these refrigerators? Now, why the heck would you want a true refrigerator? Only one way to find out, and that's by watching this video. Let's go. All right, if you're in the Denver, Colorado area, come down to our showroom. If you're in the market for remodeling your kitchen, redesigning your kitchen, we just opened up our new sort of uh, boutique kitchen center in our showroom. And part of that is our true display. So come down and check it out. Um, also, if you're new to our channel, make sure to subscribe. It helps us out a ton when you do that. All right, true refrigerators, what are they? So true refrigeration, if you go probably to any bar, restaurant, um, gas station, you know, any place that's gonna have refrigeration, you're gonna see two brands. You're gonna see Perlic and True. So True, uh, all the ballparks, like their product is in everything. Why? Because it works the best. And in commercial locations, you have to have reliable ref refrigeration or you're gonna lose your shirt, literally. Someone's gonna take your shirt. So they have a True residential line, which isn't nearly as big as their sort of standard commercial line. But to me, their, their residential line is so money. It is so sweet. And you can tell just by looking at it, how awesome it is. So I'm gonna kind of give you a rundown of the product. Uh, why it's so luxury, why it's so expensive. Are you getting what you're paying for, that type of thing. So let's start with under counter refrigeration. So all their under counter refrigeration is gonna be stainless steel interior. So stainless steel interior is really important. So we got 300 stainless steel series on the front and if you're doing stainless steel front this is uh, a colored finish it'd be stainless steel on the exterior and the interior which is really important stainless steel helps with odor or does not have odor retention so you're not going to retain odors in the refrigerators and then also um, it's going to help sort of retain that cold in there and help with efficiency so all their under counter refrigeration has that unless you're doing their ada models which is why their ada models are a little bit more affordable you can see it is available in all the colors. So we have stainless steel, white, antique white. So we have the juniper color and you can get the hardware in a bunch of different colors and we'll show you that as well. Uh, we can do beverage centers, we can do kegerators, we can do uh, you know, wine refrigerators all under counter. And then this guy is a drawer refrigerator. So that's pretty sweet. Well, I like drawer refrigerators. If, you, if this, you're gonna have your beverages or beers or whatever you want in here, you don't have to bend over. You just grab them from the top which is super handy. So that's our under counter refrigerators. So that's like the, the very, very fast review of their under counter products. Here's what's awesome though. They're one of the only brands in refrigeration. If you guys watch our channel, you know we do a ton of outdoor kitchens. Like we actually do way more outdoor kitchens than we do indoor kitchens. Here's what's so cool about their stuff. They're one of the only brands I've seen where you don't have to order a separate outdoor skew. Why is that? Because these are so, already built like tanks, they're outdoor rated. So it's not like you have to buy a more heavy duty model that can withstand the elements. The model that you have indoor is superior enough to handle the elements outdoor. So easy peasy, 70 degree, degree kitchen all day long. That tells you that if they don't need a separate skew, that these things are made awesome. Also their ice maker has a built in pump. So if you can't do a gravity feed drain, the pump's already pre-installed into the unit. And then um, it sort of makes those cute little top hat ice, which is my favorite if you're doing cocktails or something like that. And again, it's available in all the colors. All right, should we talk full stand-up fridges now, indoor fridges? All right, so stand-up fridges, really what True's been known for is their column refrigeration. They just came out with like a full, you know, refrigerator with a freezer. So this is like their first True all-in-one refrigerator, which to me is a game changer. I'm gonna talk about that in a second. Let's talk column refrigeration. Aesthetics, same thing that I mentioned before. All the colors are available. This is the matte black with the brass finish. Their compressors or the fan is gonna be in the top of these refrigerators. Let's talk performance a little bit. So we still have the same, you know, three or four interior uh, finish, which is really important for all the things I just mentioned. But that fan is gonna cool the air from the top down. Why is that important that, the, that it starts cooling from the top? Why do you think, Chris? It 
can keep your beer at the top and it gets colder <laughs> quicker. Yeah, you can have little ice crystals in your beer. No, sorry, Chris, that's not what that's for. So that is naturally heat rises. So the top is gonna stay warmer first. So by having that fan from the top down, what that does is that's gonna basically, you're not gonna have hot spots in your refrigerator. Every place in the refrigerator should be even temp, which performance wise is really important. On their column refrigerators, you can do glass doors or just like a solid finish. You don't have to do glass doors. Now we're in a showroom, so the light is always on, but we can set this to where the light uh, turns on. When the door closes, the light shuts off. So you don't always have to keep that light on. We do it because in our showroom, it just looks better and we want customers to know they can have some tasty beverages while they're in here. So we gotta show them off. So that's the columns. Now what's cool is you basically do a column for your refrigerator and a column for your freezer, usually reversed. They come in 30 inch, 36 inch and 24 inch. I forgot the 24, so you can do three sizes. Now what's really cool is they sort of just couple together and you can mix and match sizes. So if you did a 30 and a 30, you would have a 60 inch refrigerator. If you did like a, you could do like a 24 inch freezer if you don't need as much freezer space and a 30 inch refrigerator, 36, you get the point. You get what I'm saying. So it's really cool. You can do a ton of different combinations. Now the problem is with their full sort of column units is there's no built-in ice maker in the freezer or the refrigerator. So if you wanted ice, you're gonna have to do a standalone 15 inch under counter ice maker somewhere. I personally like that anyways, because to me, a regular refrigerator ice maker never produces enough ice. So I always recommend, you know, if you're doing a column setup, always throwing in an ice maker in your island or, or somewhere in the kitchen. So you can see the quality is there. Now let's talk warranty. I still gotta get to that, but let's touch on warranty for a little bit. A lot of people think that Sub-Zero Wolf, all these luxury brands are like the top dog. I promise you, this is like the best refrigerator on planet Earth, in my opinion. Now, someone's gonna hate on me for that, but you're gonna pay for it, but you're basically getting three-year warranty on all the exterior, six-year warranty on the entire sealed system, and that includes parts and labor. So for six years, you have everything. And then for 15 years, you get full warranty on all replacement parts, no labor. That's a pretty stinking good warranty. Like you're not getting that with your average refrigerator and performance wise, I really don't see it breaking down. So now let's talk about um, this 36 inch. So I think this guy was a game changer for several reasons. Uh, one is, is that obviously there's a huge market for people just doing an all-in-one refrigerator. I'd say majority of people do that versus a side-by-side -side column. And so it's pretty awesome that they're gonna have an individual pull-out freezer and then a separate refrigerator, but it's just not that simple. By the way, this is the, I, I'd be remiss if I didn't talk about this. This is their new sage color. Someone on our TikTok said in the 70s, they called that avocado. Let me know if you like sage or avocado better, but, uh, this is Sage. I think it's beautiful. And we did sort of the pewter hardware. Do you like it, Chris, or no? I like it a lot. You like it? Uh, you can do this with the same thing. You can do a solid door or you can do a glass door. Now here's some cool things about it. All the warranties, everything I just said is all the same. Again, we can shut the light on or off. Here's what's cool. So we have a fixed drawer here. This one is movable, but it's solid all the way across. But here's what's unique to them. They have this panel in the middle so you can adjust this shelving. So for example, if you need your champagne bottle to fit right here, you can do it. You can move this up a little bit, put all your champagne here, your wine here, whatever you wanna do. Then we have soft close pull out drawers with dividers. So it's gonna be soft close. These are all stainless steel too with glass. You can see that. I mean, you can just see the quality. You can feel the quality in this thing. So you're paying for it but this is a situation where you're definitely getting what you pay for. Now here's what's cool. I talked about built-in ice makers, their freezer, you know, like a typical standalone one is gonna have a built-in ice maker. Again, it's not gonna do anything near like a standalone ice maker will do, but it will do it. But here's my favorite part. And a lot of brands don't do this. They have separate condensers. They have two, two different condensers for the refrigerator and the freezer. So one, you're gonna have more of a moisture 
type air in the refrigerator for your produce, your typical refrigerator type items, and then more of a dry air on the bottom for the freezer, obviously for frozen things. So performance wise, this thing is unmatched. Now, like the columns, what's really cool, if I were building a house from scratch, it wouldn't fit in my house. This is what I would do, and it would be so baller. It would be just baller to a whole new level. You can actually couple these together. So you put two 36ers together, do a, you know, a right hinge and a left hinge, have the handles in the middle French door style with a grill connecting them on the top, and you're gonna have a 72 inch refrigerator. And it's attractive. I mean, that's crazy. I would do it, but it's crazy. So that's your refrigeration. Again, if you're thinking, if you're in the luxury marketplace for a refrigeration, here's why I think it's a good idea to spend money on refrigeration, if you're going to. If you're already gonna do a top-end kitchen, refrigerator is probably the most common, maybe that and an oven. Actually, you probably use your refrigerator more. You're gonna use your refrigerator more than any other item in your kitchen. It's usually the centerpiece of the kitchen, especially if you're doing something large. So attractive wise, I don't, I would put their attractiveness, their cosmetic look of their refrigeration up against anybody. I don't think anybody's touching it. Uh, I think they're the best looking. So if you really want a showstopper in the kitchen, do that. So you have the best aesthetics, you have the best quality, you have the best warranty. Do I need to keep going? Or do you just need a true refrigerator? So again, we're getting into the sort of the luxury sort of indoor appliance line. We're not doing a lot of appliances, but we do offer some of the top end stuff. We're gonna be making a top five refrigeration video. Based on this video, I, I bet you guys could take a guess where this, this brand is gonna fall in my top five. I think it's one of the best refrigerators on planet Earth. Uh, what our rep says, their sort of selling feature is, is if the general public trusts True Refrigerator with their food and their food safety, shown you in your house. I mean, you're trusting all these bar ballparks to serve you good food that's been refrigerated properly. Might as well, right? Might as well throw one in, right, Chris? Yeah. That's why I tell clients, they're on the fence, I just say, might as well. Might as well, should we just check you out? All right, enough of that. So come down to our showroom, check out our awesome display. If you have any questions, you can call or text our staff. We'll see you guys next time.